All right, people of YouTube, I'm here to give you guys a look at some of the knickknack film gear. Little small stuff that normally people overlook and don't really talk about when it comes to their film equipment. But I'm here to run you guys through. First and foremost, let me go ahead and close this and so you guys can see the case that I'm using. I simply got this from the hardware section at Walmart. You know, nothing spectacular, nothing out of the ordinary, just a simple, you know, hardware case. Or you can go to the sporting goods section at your, you know, Walmart or something like that. And, you know, go inside the fish fishing area and they got like little stuff like this. That's where I brought this at. That's what I was using at first, you know. And they got all these little dividers you can use and stuff like that. That's good for little miniature gear and stuff. So. I decided to get, get a bigger one to bring on different film gigs and sets with me and stuff like that. You know, so I'm gonna go ahead and run you guys through each compartment and what I got inside there and how much, you know, it came in handy and, you know, just little, all my little knickknacks. So over right here, we have, you know, the, the body cap and lens cap. Well, not cap, but it's the back cap for the lens to go on back of the lens. Um, battery for my, um, Lily put seven inch monitor. These are different battery chargers, you know, off brand third party batteries and the chargers you get with it, you know. So, this is for my C100 batteries. This one, I like how these come apart too, because that's the only way that's able to fit inside this compartment by sliding that off, you know. But this is for my, um, are those Sony batteries? I think those are off brand Sony batteries, you know, for my like my lights and stuff like that. So, that's what that's for. I'm gonna slide that back off. Put that right there. This right here is for the charger for this battery, an external charger. You can also charge these batteries up um, through the screen itself. So if you got one of these inside the screen, you can plug the little other charger up to the screen and charge it up like that. Um, over here is like my. This is my favorite stuff right here. This stuff comes in handy all my little different arms and stuff like that. These little things, you know, even these little things come in handy. Um, stuff like this. Stuff like this is such a lifesaver. You can like just customize your rig and all kind of stuff, all kind of different ways just by using these little things. This little spacer came in handy, most definitely. Especially when I need to screw something like this to one end and then turn around and screw something else to that end. You know, this is, you know, provides for that. Um, these most definitely come in handy right here. These bad boys. It's kind of like the same thing with this, but the opposite, male to male. This is female, female. So these are both, oh my God, like lifesavers right here. Comes in so much handy. And then this too. These, instead of using like a, a flathead screwdriver or I got a quarter inside here too that I keep inside here. Get to that department in a second. But instead of using like the little screw, you can, they got like a little thumb thing right there. You can twist it like that. That comes in handy. Especially like on quick release plates and stuff like that. Um, HDMI, HDMI covers, plastic covers, to protect your cable. This goes on top of my pole, like one of my tripod poles to protect the uh, threads. Or since it's the industry standard thread, I can put it like on something like this to pr protect this. Or something like this, you know, to protect that. But it's not, it ain't that necessary, but you never know. Got a cold shoe, mini cold shoe to uh, cold shoe, or mini hot shoe to cold shoe, whichever, whichever one. I use this for my Canon uh, Vixia HF G30 and G10. Well, only on my G10, G30 came with a regular size shoe. You know what I'm saying? Little stuff like this. So if you wanna mount this onto a cold shoe or something like that, put some other stuff on top, you know, I could do that you know what I'm saying a little stuff like that over here we got double-sided tape heavy-duty double-sided tape um, you know Allen wrenches you got to have these most definitely all kind of different sizes you know you never know when you're gonna need these 
some of my, like my shoulder rig uses this some of these so if I need something tightened down something had got loose bam I got a quarter inside here if I can get to it this is used to tighten stuff down let's say I, I don't feel like breaking up my flathead screwdriver I just want to do something real quick bam or this not this not as strong as the quarter but right here we have another thing you see this is kind of bent too you know what I'm saying so this is real finicky but this is a brand new you know protect your wipe cleaning cloth you never know something might happen some water might splash or you know whatever I can break this open clean off something real quick you know comes in handy it's like backup you know what I'm saying I love stuff like this I love backup type stuff you know mini HDMI I got an elbow elbow HDMI male to female or female to male quick release plate might need an extra one of those probably mount this onto another camera or something like that or to a different device so I can put directly onto my tripod real easily um, zip ties I don't, do I need to explain how handy zip, zip ties come in handy what, 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 just put it like this what if I didn't have some of these mounting things and I needed to mount something onto something zip ties I got short ones I got long ones down there dry erase marker for my um follow focus which I never used ever I use my follow focus plenty of times but I never used this maybe because I haven't really shot no movies yet that's probably why um this bad boy right here simple it's, it slides onto a cold shoe or hot shoe or whatever the case may be and then it has some other shoes right there you can you know for accessories you guys get what that's for this is something that came with this is all plastic mostly pretty much this came with something. I forgot what this came with, but I took it off and I can still utilize this with something. This can't put nothing heavy up on here. You can adjust these any kind of way and then tighten it down, you know. Um, battery charger, cigarette um, lighter, battery charger. You know what I'm saying? It's good to have these around. When your battery's dying or something like that, you can easily plug this up. Take this, you know what I'm saying, boom. That's, what, that's one thing I never understood. How come the off-brand stuff got stuff like this, but the official stuff don't have anything like this? This even has a USB port. Come on, man. <laughs> um, this is the microphone holder from my C100 Mark II, which I'm filming with right now. Um, another little plaque, uh, pl plaque, plastic finicky little piece that came with something, that, a different accessory that I had, but I kept it anyways. Got the little metal threads inside there I can screw this down into something and you know got two heads on each side so you know never know where to come in handy this is part of my shoulder rig I don't know why this is inside here I should put that over there actually so over here we got clamps I got more of these too but these come in handy never know when you're gonna need these you know what I'm saying um, gears for lenses so if you want to put your lens on a follow focus you know Put this around your lens and then you're able to use the follow focus, you know what I'm saying? Focus your lens instead of turning like that with your lens. Um, this is something that I have found that I just end up keeping. It's like a little, I think it's for clothes. It's like a little hook. You can hook it onto something and then, you know, it holds on. It, it's, it can't hold that much weight, but you can use this like to hold a piece of paper or something or hold something, you know what I'm saying? It's, I like little knickknack stuff like this because you get just... I'm, I'm good at rigging up stuff. Just put it like that. Real good at that. Extremely good. Too good. Let me stop. But anyways, here's a little hood, which I don't need. Well, this fits my Canon T4i, which I'm debating on selling. So. Because I was using that for my vlog camera and to take photos every once in a while. But after viewing some photos that I shot with my 6D, cause I was mostly using my 6D for videos. You guys know I'm a videographer first, but when I'm looking at some photos from my 6D that I took, I'm like, bruh, I need another 6D or something or some other full frame Canon camera to take pictures because this, these pictures look amazing. And this, this T4i can do nothing like this. 
And like I said, I mainly bought the T4i for vlogging anyways with my wide angle lens, but I'm gonna sell that and get a GoPro instead. You know, I'm just gonna go that route. Official Canon battery for the C100 Mark II, but I never use the official batteries for any of my cameras. I always use the official batteries as backup batteries. Most people use the official battery to film and use these as backup, backup batteries, the off-brand batteries. That's backwards to me, because what if you're filming and you're using this as your main battery and this happened to not even have a charge because it failed, but you don't know that. You think it's charged up and it's sitting inside your gear. You take this battery off because you ran out of juice. You put this battery in, you'd have messed up because now this battery, this battery doesn't even work because you know it had failed on you without you even knowing. If you use these as your main batteries, then you automatically gonna know right away when they fail on you. If they do happen to fail, which I never had any batteries fail on me, that was third party batteries. But if they do happy, happen to do that to you, then you will know right away and you can could, you could say, okay, I'm gonna go to my official battery that's gonna work for sure. So I always use my official battery as my backup because that's actually something I can really rely on if something happens, you know. And then these batteries right here, you see how easily, like see how perfectly these fit inside here? That's crazy. You know what I'm saying? I, f I found that to be real cool, you know what I'm saying? It seemed like this case is made for that. So, and these got dividers too. I can divide the stuff up for, for no reason whatsoever. I can divide the batteries up <laughs> for what though? You know, these little, these little parts right here automatically keep the batteries in their place. So I don't need that. These are uh, the Sony batteries I was telling, telling you about that goes with this. I think these are Sony batteries or Sony off-brand batteries, should I say. I use these for my LED lights small ones I'm getting some big ones later on down the line I'm gonna need the big capacity batteries these obviously are tools and for sure had to get me one of these cuz I realized screwing this into hold on into this it took or even if screwing this into something else, you can't screw that back off with your hand. Like it's almost impossible. Like I tried so hard. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna buy some tools. I keep inside my little carrying case and you know, they come with some rent, a wrench or something like that. And so I can be able to like, you know, screw the stuff off. Screws, these go inside here too. Got to put these back inside here, but these are dry, drywall screws, but I use these universally to screw inside a lot of different stuff. So, Hey, you never know when you need some screws for something. Maybe you're on set and something happens or you, you know, I just, I can't, I can't even think of a scenario because you just never know. You know what I'm saying? It's just for rigging up stuff just in case. You know what I'm saying? I carry all this stuff around all the time, especially the double-sided tape, the zip ties. I supposed to have scissors inside here too. Where the hell happened to my scissors? Had to put the scissors back inside here. Somebody show up on set and I don't got nothing like this. I can't even take them serious because you know you gotta have like your your case full of just stuff. You know what I'm saying your knickknack stuff. <laughs>